Prince George has won the hearts of people around the world after he was publicly shamed for taking ballet lessons by a U.S. television host who has since been condemned for her remarks around the globe. But will the future king of Great Britain's daunting curriculum even permit him time for extracurricular activities? Prince George is the eldest son of Prince William and Kate Middleton, the Duchess of Cambridge, making him third in the line of success to the British throne. He was born on July 22, 2013, and recently celebrated his sixth birthday. The young royal will begin year two in just a few short days as he returns to Thomas's Battersea. But what does the curriculum for Prince George's next school year actually look like? Prince George attends Thomas's Battersea School in London and he will soon be joined by his sister Princess Charlotte when term begins in September. The private school costs roughly £6,110 a term and is attended by both boys and girls between the ages of 4 and 13. The school has a focus on the arts, sports and outdoor activities as well as academics. But as Prince George graduates from year 1 to year 2, he is likely to see a daunting increase in workload as the young royal enters his last year in the lower school. According to the Thomas's Battersea's website, there are three classes in year two and each of the three classes has a form teacher and a full-time teaching assistant work is shared between two classes. Classes are of mixed ability and, as far as possible, have equal numbers of boys and girls. The website lists the subjects on the curriculum as, Literacy, Numeracy, Science, Topic, History and Geography, RS, French, Sh, Art, Computing, Music, Swimming, Ballet, Pay and Games. The school adds that many of these subjects are taught by specialist teachers and each half term the children wander off site on a woodland adventure as part of Thomas's outdoor education program. Head of lower school Helen Heslam writes, the emphasis in the lower school is on enjoyment and this is embedded in our broad curriculum and our most important school rule of be kind. Children quickly settle into the routines and expectations of the school where the atmosphere is noticeably happy, yet stimulating in nature. Our foremost aim is to ensure that every child feels safe, happy and confident at school. We help to create an environment in which children are eager to learn and to take an active part in their own learning. We are proud of our creative curriculum and the children quickly become immersed in their topics and engage in all learning experiences presented to them. Progress is carefully monitored and supported by the form teacher, the teaching assistant and specialist teachers. By year two, the children become the leaders of the lower school. This increasing independence and maturity helps them to prepare for a smooth transition to the middle school. During his time in reception, Prince George was required to undertake at least 10 minutes worth of reading every day as his homework. While in year one, George was expected to, to undertake at least 10 minutes worth of reading each day as well as a weekly spelling list and optional online maths activities. Now that he will be a year two pupil, he is expected to undertake at least 10 minutes worth of reading every day, reading comprehension exercises once reading becomes fluent a weekly spelling list and optional online maths activities. Prince George and Princess Charlotte will attend Thomas's Battersea for the first day of term on Thursday, September 5th. Once Prince George reaches 13, he will begin to look for another school and will most likely attend the boys' public school Eton College, as his father and uncle Prince Harry did before him. Meanwhile, Princess Charlotte will most likely follow in her mother's footsteps and attend Marlborough College. Princess Charlotte is already enjoying the perks of being the younger sister to the future king after it emerged her school fees will be more than £100 cheaper than Prince George's. George, 6 and Charlotte, 4, have just a few days left to enjoy the long summer break until it is back to school in September. The only daughter of Prince William and Kate. Duchess of Cambridge will join George as a pupil at Thomas's Battersea in West London. The four-year-old will enter reception and will be charged almost 2% less than George who will enter year two, as she will be the second child from the family to attend the prestigious education centre. The private school rated outstanding by Ofsted, 
charges the eldest child who falls into the reception to year 2 bracket, £6,429 per term. However the cost falls for the second child to £6,305, making a saving of £124. In three years time if their youngest brother Prince Louis, 1, also attends the school, the cost for the third child comes in at £5,790. Earlier this year, the headmaster at Thomas's Battersea, Simon O'Malley, said the school were delighted to welcome another member of the royal family. In a statement, Mr O'Malley said, We are delighted that the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge have decided that Princess Charlotte will join her elder brother, Prince George, at Thomas's Battersea. We greatly look forward to welcoming her and all of our new pupils to the school in September. Royal biographer Penny Jr. has said George will be sure to look out for his little sister during her first days at her new school. She told Hello, Prince George is a very protective and lovely older brother. I'm sure he'll look after his little sister and take great pride in showing her the ropes. The prestigious West London School has outlined its values to ensure every pupil fulfill his or her potential and aims to create an environment which inspires enjoyment, learning and achievement. On its website the school says, It is our aim that each child in our care aspires to fulfill his or her potential. We would like every pupil to become the best that he or she can be. In each school, we aim to offer the highest academic standards, set within a broad and rich curriculum, which inspires enjoyment, learning and achievement. We expect every member of the school's communities to be kind. Charlotte will enjoy her first day on September 5 and is set to be in for a fun-filled learning experience. The school states during the reception year, children will play and explore, make choices and learn to have a go and persevere, be creative and solve problems, form good relationships, be safe, secure and happy. The fourth in line to the throne will also study seven core areas including personal, social and emotional development. PSED, Communication and Language, CL, Physical Development, PD, Literacy, Mathematics, Understanding the World, UTW, and Expressive Arts and Design, EAD. The state-of-the-art school also boasts some of the best facilities in the country including a one-acre playground. Thomas's Battersea has learning facilities including an historic Great Hall which is equipped as a theater, a gymnasium, a ballet room and three fully equipped science laboratories. Pupils also have access to two large and light art rooms plus a pottery room, a spacious music school, including a recital room and instrumental practice rooms, two libraries and two computing suites.